your first alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Brad Travis. A beautiful afternoon. I don't think we're going to see any thunderstorms for the rest of the day, but the latest forecast guidance coming in, I'll share it with you in a second, is showing a fairly robust round of thunderstorms possible late tomorrow afternoon at about this time. So we're going to go through that hour by hour in a second. Good looking view here. Wilson Dam out in the shoals, 86 on the Fly Breeze camera network, 88 in Huntsville, 86 out in the shoals, 89 right now in Russellville. Official high today so far, 90 in Huntsville, the first 90 degree day here in 2023. Rain chances are going up for tomorrow evening in particular. We'll get there in a second. Thursday night, I think we have a round of thunderstorms, so we may have two back to back days with uh, fairly significant thunderstorms coming in from the southwest. Very heavy rain producers, strong gusty winds, a lot of lightning, typically what you associate with stronger thunderstorms in the summertime. It's kind of a summertime atmosphere. Then as you get into the weekend, your Friday, a few isolated thunderstorms, same thing Saturday. And then Sunday, I think we get a break from Mother's Day. Nothing out there on the radar right now, and I don't expect anything for the rest of the evening. Uh, the boundary we had come through this morning, and that's what's going to happen here. It's what's shifting here, and that's what's been so tricky in the forecast. Long range is we've had these complexes of storms dropping in from the north, and the boundary that's left over is lighting up with a few showers and storms from Birmingham south towards Montgomery and Auburn. Uh, but really, the big story today surrounds this tropical low almost. It's an upper level cutoff low, and it's just spinning here easy near Port Arthur, Texas. This is going to drift to the north. These are very hard to predict where they're going to go. And I think we're going to start to see more of an influence like what you see here from Jackson up into northern Louisiana about this time tomorrow as it lifts in from the southwest. So very heavy rain producers. Here's what we're talking about tomorrow morning. Not much going on early tomorrow afternoon. Showers and thunderstorms start to fire up. This is earlier than what we were showing you earlier as well. See that area of rain extending far to the north from the northwest to the southeast. Again, this is all dependent on where that upper level low ends up. And I already I just mentioned how tough they are to forecast for. So it doesn't make it any easier for us meteorologists here either. But that's the, the best look right now is a round of showers and storms tomorrow afternoon. As we get into Thursday, we start off dry again. That upper level low still out to the west. See what it's doing here at one o'clock. Some stronger thunderstorms south of Memphis towards Tupelo kind of moving through as we get into seven o'clock Thursday evening. Heavy downpours, a lot of lightning. These could actually have some isolated damaging wind gusts too. So we'll have to watch that threat as this moves east and northeast into the metro area around eight o'clock. Again, that's kind of the first look at that feature, that storm system, the timing will likely change and of course the position of the storms mowing forecast we're going to go fair really for the rest of the week 10 day forecast warmed it up to 87 tomorrow after today's 90 84 thursday 84 friday and then as we get into the weekend again mother's day very it's a hot mother's day out there a morning low of 67 on into next week more isolated afternoon air mass type thunderstorms